Welcome back to another quick guide today I'll teach you how to connect OBS to Ermi TV 2024. To connect OBS to Ermi TV on Windows, you'll need to configure OBS as a virtual webcam. Here's a step-by-step -step guide. First, let's enable the virtual camera and OBS. So OBS is a built-in virtual camera feature that allows you to use its output as a webcam source for OMI TV. Now open OBS Studio. In the bottom right corner, click Start Virtual Camera. This will allow OBS to act as a webcam. Now let's set up your webcam feed and OBS. In OBS, go to the Sources box. Right click on the empty space, then click on add, a new source, then choose video capture device. Choose your webcam as the source and click OK. Adjust the size and position of your webcam feed and OBS canvas to fit your preferences. Let's configure virtual camera output. And OBS, click on settings for the virtual camera. Set the output type to default and click OK. Now, let us download and set up additional camera files. To further customize the virtual camera setup, follow these steps. Here's the link provided below to download the required files. After the download is complete, extract the files by right-clicking and selecting Extract All. Open the extracted folder. Run the OBS Camera 1 file. And follow the same process for OBS Camera 2. Restart OBS Studio once the setup is complete. Let's access OMTB and manage camera settings. Open your preferred web browser and search for OMI TV. If you encountered an access denied message, follow these steps. Click on the three dots in your browser's top right corner. Then go to settings. In the left hand panel, choose privacy and security. Then navigate to site settings. Scroll down to camera and choose the correct camera, such as HD camera C922X. Next, disable physical cameras. If you're still facing issues, try disconnecting any physical cameras from your PC or disable your laptop's built-in camera. So now, I'm still using a PC. Right-click on the Windows icon and choose Device Manager. Expand the Camera section. Right-click on your camera name and choose Disable. Then, we have to restart the PC for the changes to take effect. Now, refresh Irma TV and re-enable cameras. Refresh Irma TV in your browser if an OBS output is shown. You can now reconnect or re-enable your camera. Plug in your camera if you unplugged it earlier. Enable your camera through Device Manager if you disabled it before. Now, ensure that HD camera C922X or your desired camera is selected in the camera settings and you should now be able to connect OBS to OMI TV. And that's all for now folks, thanks for watching.